So what is going on guys? It's Crisis Diamago here coming at you live and in person and I want to first get to the gameplay that you guys are going to be watching. I'm playing Team Deathmatch on Gold Mud Railway and I'm also playing my friend Alcavar. We were playing the other night. I just gotten off of work and I was like, let's see how this goes. So we were playing and we actually played until pretty late in, into the night and I was getting tired. But this is actually one of the better gameplays from that night. I did really, really well. You guys are going to see me go on quite the tear here. I'm actually going to burn all of my ammo and have to pick up an enemy's weapon. I'm going to go on a little bit of a tear with that as well. So you're going to see a little bit of diversity with this gameplay as far as how I play. Because I'm not used to the gun that I pick up, I am running the Bulldog with Suppressor, Ergo Group, and I think Coyote Sight. And then I'm also running, of course, the Deagle 44. But I'm going to end up picking an M416 up here later on. But that's it for the gameplay. What I want to talk to you guys about is a little bit of a personal and channel update. Just because a lot of things have been going on here lately. And I haven't really been doing very many commentaries. It's more been montages and things like that. So I wanted to just give you guys an update about things that are going on in my life. Things that are going on with my channel and all that fun stuff. So... The first thing, and this is probably the biggest thing that I'm happy about in my life right now, is work is finally, finally starting to slow down. We are finally starting to hire some new people at work. Every one of my coworkers and myself are absolutely burnt out. We've all been working between 50 and 60 hours a week. And for those of you who are new to my channel or maybe you haven't seen some of my older videos, I work in a group home with individuals who have disabilities, so it's a very mentally taxing job. And it's just, you need a break every now and again. Again, I, I love my job. I would never, never bash my job or anything like that. I love it. It's just, we've been so short-handed for probably two and a half, three months now. We've been really, really short-handed with staff, and that leaves a lot of the other staff, including myself, to pick up the pieces and have to work all these insane hours so we've hired like three or four new people things are finally starting to slow down which means I'm getting more time off from work which means I'm getting more time to edit make videos so look for a lot more videos coming to my channel here soon probably starting next month because that's when things are really gonna start to slow back down and I'm not gonna be working so much crazy overtime so that's one really awesome thing about my life that's been going on the other thing is I have been spending a lot of time with friends lately this is something I haven't been doing and it's kind of affected YouTube a little bit uh, I'm not gonna lie I've kind of gotten a little lazy just making montages and things like that and not actually sitting down doing commentaries but every now and again uh, you just you need to take a break from things go hang out with friends and I actually went to the mall on Monday for the first time in probably like three years. It has been three years since I got to get together with a group of friends and go to my mall that's like an hour away. I was so excited, and a lot of people think go to the mall. I probably do that every weekend. For me, it's a big deal because it's the first time I got to hang out with a group of friends in a very long time. And the weather's starting to get nicer, being able to go to a lake that I live by and just hang out with friends and things like that. So it's something that's been good for me to do. It kind of keeps my mind off of everything, kind of keeps me sane a little bit, and everybody needs a break, like I said, now and again, especially with work. It's just good to get away for a little while, and yeah, like I said, it has has made me a little bit lazy with my commentaries here lately, but I'm fixing that now that I'm going to have some more time off of work. I'm going to get more time to do commentaries and everything like that, so I guess that is a good transition into my channel. And if you guys haven't seen my previous videos where I explained that I got partnered by Evolution, which is powered by Freedom, it's a Freedom Network, and that's, I'm really, really excited about this because a recruiter actually came to me and said, hey, I like your videos, and we talked for a while, and it wasn't just a, okay, well, I'm going to sign up, blah, blah, blah. I actually, we talked for a little bit, he was really understanding, he really seemed to like my content, and everything like that and he also was saying about how with this network there are people who could help me create better content not that my content's not bad but it's not the best and I'll be the first to admit that I don't have the best content on YouTube and everybody can take advice from now and again so 
it's really, really awesome. And I never really thought that I'd ever get partnered with any network. That's, I uploaded videos because videos were fun for me to make. I enjoyed playing video games and, you know, it was just, it was, it was kind of like an outlet for me, a way for me to talk about things, to get other people's feedback and just a way to connect with some other people. And I'm really glad that I started doing it. Really glad that I started doing commentaries. And I think I'm going to be doing it for a while. As long as I can anyway. To, you know, until... Until uh, I find a video game that I don't like to play anymore. Or I just don't like playing video games altogether. Or something like that happens. Because I enjoy doing it. I know I'm probably never going to get to the level of some of these other YouTubers. And that's fine. I don't... I'm not in it for the money. I'm in it because it's fun. I enjoy playing video games. And I actually do enjoy talking to other people every now and again, contrary to popular belief. So, that's one thing. And I'm really, really excited. I got a pretty cool montage coming up. Speaking of how I've been lazy and just making montages, it's a sniper montage. It's Battlefield 4 gameplay. So, it's not really quick scopes, but it's just super long range headshots, one shot kills, um, just crazy shots i had this one in the video it's, it was when it happened i was playing with my friend alcovar again and i was just like oh man that's going in the montage i actually shot through my teammate's head and into an enemy's head and killed him in one shot and i was like yes it's so awesome i did like a little bunny jump in 360 and hopped around i was so excited so you guys will get to see that it's really really funny uh, i know my teammate was kind of probably not real happy with me that i shot through this his head to get to the enemy but doesn't matter because I got the kill so that's all that really matters and I'm gonna be doing some more stuff like that and I've gotten a few questions on why I don't play GTA anymore or why I don't really don't upload GTA anymore to be honest with you guys it's because GTA is boring for me ever since the Independence Day DLC came out which lasted about a week for me <laughs> I I really just don't want to play GTA 5 anymore it's so boring and I just don't, I just don't feel like it, to be 100% honest with you guys. I'd much rather play a game like Battlefield or something like that. I've even been playing some NBA 2K14, um, because contrary to popular belief, I am pretty much a sports nut, so all you guys out there who think you're bad at like Madden 25 or NBA 2K14, throwing down an open challenge, you guys can hit me up on social medias and, uh, We'll challenge play PlayStation 3. Comment me your uh, your gamer tags. We'll get at it. I'll probably get my ass kicked because I'm not that good. I'm way better at first person shooters, but we'll we'll play some sports games. Um, like I said, I'm not not the greatest out there, but I can hold my own, especially Madden. I'm pretty good at Madden. But yeah, so open challenge. Hit me up. Let's see what you guys are made of out there. Now, I know I'm probably just going to get like a bunch of people just smack talking. F you, crisis, you suck. I'll kick your ass any day. But that's all right, because that's interaction. And I want to see what you guys are made of out there. And I just like interacting with different people. So, like I said, comment down in the comment section below your gamer tags. Hit me up on social media. We'll get together and we'll play some. And NBA 2K14, Madden 25, if you guys play any of those, that's what we'll play. Or even if you guys play Battlefield and you just want to hook up in a squad and play together. I don't want to play with Alcavar and my friend Lego that you guys have heard from on my channel before. It's pretty much all of who I really play with. So, But yeah, it'll be fun. So that pretty much wraps it up here, guys. Not a whole lot more to say. All my social media links are going to be down in the description below. And you guys can hit me up on any of those. Also, inb inbox me ugh, here on YouTube. And I'll be sure to answer as many questions as possible and things like that. And the match is almost over. Not quite, but it's close. So I'm just going to switch over to some game audio. Let you guys finish watching the rest of the match if you would like to. And with that being said, guys, I'm Crisis Diamago, and I'll see you when I see you.
This will be ours. 